What's up guys? Today we're going to do a review on a shop vac that I purchased at Home Depot for about 130 bucks, 128. Uh, it's a rigid, pretty sweet unit. Here it is. It's a 16 gallon wet dry vacuum. And the reason I purchased this was because it was one of their uh, highest horse 6.5 is a 16 gallon and it's also a detachable blower which i thought was pretty sweet now you got some uh dual flex locking hose which it locks to the vacuum and to your whatever attachment you're using and uh let's open this guy up see what it's all about i don't think i'm certified around this motion you sure Hold this out, sir. It's all in here. Oh, man. This is for your blower. No destructions. No destruction. Everything's probably inside. This is pretty huge. Yes, there they are. It's a pretty big filter. We got more attachments. The wheels. The wheels. Put this guy together, what you think? Got three wheelies. Got your own hose. There you go, fourth one. This here is the highest rated horsepower. Dag dome blower slash vacuum on this side of Mississippi, maybe even the Americas. You heard it here first. There it is, all put together. These guys just snap in from the bottom, and uh, so do your little casters. Got your drain up front. I like how the these guys hold your accessories. It's pretty neat. Your hose, it's not too long, but it'll do. The power cord about 20 feet, give or take. And uh, the sweet part is up here. Put it down. So this is the You're doing fantastic. Becomes a blower somehow. Oh, check it out. Okay. It just locks in, twist and lock. Push her in with a good force. She's locked in and now she's a blower. So let's put her in and see how bad she sucks. Or how good she sucks, however. Are you assuming that vacuum's gender? Sorry. You want me to restart? No. <laughs> We're good, bro. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't help myself. Alright, so let's plug her in. Yeah, forgot to mention this hose is almost three inches, like two and a half. Sucking up some some debris. It's a monster. It's a monster. Like I said, you got your locking tabs. You got a little ridge there and you got locks in place on both ends of the hose. So you got your ribs there. 
Hang on. Ribs for her pleasure. Yes. Don't bomb me when I'm cleaning my room. Try some different ones. Again. Oh, this is like the lily pad. It's like I guess if you have like a dog hair or animal hair, this rubber should pull it up out of from wherever. Fucking little hairs going on. That's, that's pretty neat. If one was a little bit smaller, I think it'd be a lot better. Let's try it out. for that uh, hard to reach areas or if you just got done creating a lot of wood dust and debris you can connect these guys connect them Use it to clean your, your area. It's a, a vacuum. A good it's way. supposed to. <laughs> Let's put this guy back on here. I want to really test out the blower. Let's test this guy out. To remove the blower, you push down on this guy. Push down. Pops right off. Yeah. Two for two. Anyways, another reason why I purchased this is because I want to start getting into uh, car detailing. And this would be really good to, you know, vacuum your vehicle first. And then I got another video that I need to shoot, which I think you guys would like. It's, uh, just kidding, I'm not going to tell you what it is. But anyways, this is a review on this rigid vacuum. 16 gallon with a detachable blower pretty sweet i like it 
and uh, that's all for now. 6.5 whole horsepowers. All day long.